and we are homing the Connecting Ecology Symposium, which is a response to the Pope's encyclical on climate change. We've got a bunch of climate scientists, ethicists, theologians gathered here to have a sort of open discussion in symposium around the theme of the environment, climate, ecology, and generally how we can respond positively as academics, as human beings, uh, to the effect on the environment. The Connecting Ecology Symposium is really unique because it brings together theologians and social scientists and natural scientists and climate scientists to talk about these big major issues of the 21st century. And I think what we're finding out is each one of us is learning from the rich number of different perspectives on the problem, how really complex it is. I hope to get out more of perspective of the, this symposium. I mean, I think really to understand the depth of the ecological aspects of society and also to understand really how we can create a new relationship between humans and nature. I think that's something of what I'm hoping to, to, to understand more about through this symposium. I think a lot of positive things will come out of this um, because people are making connections with people from different disciplines, from different traditions of thought, different parts of the world. And you can see it in the, conversa in the side conversations, especially where people follow up and they say, oh, can you give me the bibliography for that? Or, oh, I like this idea, can you tell me more about that? And uh, you see people kind of making these new connections that uh, you know, are harder to see from within your own discipline sometimes. I think the symposium can indeed be very positive in a number of respects. First of all, I think that um, having the kind of interdisciplinary conversations we've been having with scientists, with social scientists, theologians, ethicists, etc., um, means that we, have, we are developing a common vocabulary. And I think that's absolutely essential in terms of the um, addressing this uh, issue. I think in addition, uh, we are really, as I said already, converging on asking the critical questions about now that we understand and um, this analysis about this interconnected crisis, how do we move forward in terms of uh, making real change, not only in terms of our politics and our ethics, but also in terms of our um, interiority in a way. I came to this as a great pessimist about whether significant progress can be made regarding climate change. As Pope Francis says in Laudato Si, there's an immense lack of political will. But here I have gained encouragement. Um, everyone is very realistic, and yet at the same time we've seen examples of progress, of alliances being made, and even of breakthroughs coming through from the Paris Agreement. So all the disciplines coming together, all the different voices, it's been tremendous. To me, it was a great uh, inspiration to read more about Lada to see, and I'd expected as I came here to really understand m more of new angles that I haven't been aware of before. The symposium is great. I actually like, I very much like the way in which we're moving around, the way in which it is conceived of as um, multiple conversations in lots of different venues. I think that's the way in which conferences should be uh, organized. I also very much like the hospitality. Mm -hmm.